Hey everybody, this is my version of cockroach donuts with a Boston cream filling. They're so delicious. It's Pinterest's top trending recipe for Halloween. First, you have to make the dough. I'm gonna add my dry ingredients into the mixer. Got the sugar, got a bit of salt, and the flour. Let's take this out. Now I'm gonna add in my wet ingredients and my dry ingredients. So I added the milk and the butter. I'm gonna add in one egg, the yeast with the warm water. And there we go. Really simple. Turn it on a low, we'll start it off low. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna let it sit in the mixing bowl and double in size. But there you go, you're gonna have a sweet dough and it's gonna be perfect for the cockroach bodies. Then we're gonna roll it out and I'm gonna show you the rest. So now that I've got it rolled out here, now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut these into ovals. This water it makes it stick. It's kind of like a glue. Like that. Oof. That definitely is starting to look like a scary cockroach. It's like this. It looked like little legs, and yeah, that looks kind of like a leg to me. I'm gonna drop them in this oil. This is about 350 degrees, um, and let those fry up. Oh yeah, nice and golden brown, just like you like them and make a little incision. You don't want to cut all the way through. Just make a little incision in the dough with the tip of the paring knife, straight across the head like that. Really carefully. There you go, just drop them in. There we go. Flip them over, so just take a little spatula or other and just flip them nice and get them all brown on both sides. That's smelling delicious. This dough, there's nothing that smells better than fried dough, let me tell you. It, Smells pretty good when you're frying dough up. Okay, next step is making the pastry cream. It's the filling for the cockroach bodies. So the first thing I'm gonna do is warm my milk, my sugar, all right, here. And there we go. And I'll whisk this all together. There we go. And that's gonna get nice and warm. Corn starch goes in, that's just for thickening. So I'm gonna mix this right there, and I mix it in really well. Temper together, then I can add all of my milk mixture in here. Which should happen pretty quickly. So this will start thickening up pretty fast because of the cornstarch. And you'll have a great pastry mix. So now my pastry cream has been cooled and I'm gonna make the filling for the cockroach donuts because now it's getting really fun putting this together. So you add in your pastry cream. Now I've whipped cream and I just whipped it until I had stiff peaks. And then what I do is I add my pastry cream in. Put this together. There we go. Okay, so I put my pastry cream, my slimy pastry cream in a bag, a piping bag. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn these over and then just fill that baby up. There you go. And then flip them over. And now we're gonna glaze them. We're gonna glaze the top of the cockroach. We're gonna glaze it in dark chocolate. Yep, the butter actually adds another level of fat to keep it nice and smooth. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna all now add in my sugar, confectioner sugar. Here we go. So nice warm water in there. Again, this just brings it all together for a nice smooth glaze that we're gonna make these cockroaches nice and dark on the outside. Now I'm gonna decorate the donuts with caramel strips. So what you wanna do is take some caramel pieces, just candies, and you're gonna put them in the microwave for about 10 seconds. Let's do that. Take a rolling pin and roll it out nice and thin. This is the fun part. There we go. Kind of paint a little bit of the black on there. There it is. Stick those right in. Nice. These are the cockroach donuts. This is my version. And you can just pull the leg off, eat the leg, open it up. Oh yeah, look at that, it's so slimy inside. So grossly delicious.